Hello dear honorable viewers, welcome to everybody to my today's tutorial. I think all of you are well, I am also well. So let's uh, start the session. Our today's session, how to write a journal. In your previous session already we have discussed journal on day 1 and day 2. And in this tutorial we will discuss day 3 and day 4. And before going that, now we are going to discuss what are the benefits of journal writing uh, or why have we have to uh, write journal because journal uh, writing is very important for memorizing the training topics uh, so focuses you to practice the act of writing allows you to explore your new idea provides a specific practice expressive writing without pressure Become more confident about writing, broaden your perspective about topics, gather materials for later essays, identify progresses in writing, overcome writing blocks, spend more time on self-reflection. That is very important. When we think about the topic of our training, uh, we, uh, we become more confident. So uh, this is uh, very important for self-reflection or self-assessment, uh, write without fear of criticism. So we can say that journal writing is very much uh, essential or very important for uh, fruitful training. So uh, when we have to write a journal, we should follow the questions. What have you learned? What, you ha what have you learned previous day or day three, day four, such as? What was new to you? How could you apply those in your classroom teaching? When you teach the class in your school, how could you apply uh, these topics knowledge? What was not clear to you? Which one did you find difficult? Which one is not relevant to the content of EFT book? Write your comments on the uh, on that sessions. So let us start uh, journal day three and day four. Uh, we are going to day three and day four. This is uh, the reflective journal day three and dear participant you have to write the journal on a a4 size paper and uh, here is uh, overall supervision direction and also presented by you at uh, date uh, so now i am going to start day three session day three journal good morning all all are, all are welcome to my presentation dear honorable participant how are you now I am going to present my journal based on day three activities. Our honorable trainer discussed about four sessions previous day. It was listening, listening and speaking skill, listening skill, speaking skill and applying pronunciation, punctuation, stress and intonation according with EFT. I have learned a lot of things, uh, activities from the four session. Listening and speaking skill is very essential for language learning uh, and such as uh, you have to uh, provide this. The importance of practicing listening and speaking at primary level is needed very much. I have realized the importance of learning and speaking skill and more. Also found that there is a list of activity, either listening or speaking or both in every lesson uh, of English for today class books. People use language in different purposes. When we say communicate or read something, we pause a little or something, sometimes more. Again, good pronunciation is important for spoken. speaking. Our voice usually goes up and goes down when we talk to others. Besides this, while speaking, we need to give force to a particular syllables on a word or also some keywords of a speech. All the things or factors carry a lot of meanings in English. This knowledge and applying proper teaching methods and techniques of punctuation, pronunciation, stress and intonation is according with EFT to make students learning easy and effectively. Secondly, the pronunciation of uh, alphabet. The pronunciation of alphabet is new to me from grade on. If we try to help our students correct pronunciation, they will be able to uh, pronounce it properly. In future, they will be, be a good speaker. In our lower primary, level 80 percent skill based on listening and speaking and i believe myself that i could apply all new things in my classroom and number four everything is clear to me and i enjoy every session 
or expert trainer clear to us every topics but applying pronunciation is new to me our trainer gives us a video link for practicing uh, no session is difficult to me no session is difficult to me uh, use of pronunciation uh, is very important pronunciation is a set of specific marks or symbol punctuation that we use to express the meaning of sentences clearly and to make the follow of the text flow of the text is smooth pronunciation is an important part of speaking somebody may speak english fluently and accurately but if he or she her pronunciation is very poor then people can't understand her is or she is saying every session is closely related to our eft book as a teacher we should follow the correct pronunciation we should take some steps for good sound stage and intonation such as drill both individually and crossly besides this we enjoy some warm up activities and game such as mix and mingle game bingo and snap game and also some songs in many cases i try my best to follow my in my school or classroom i shall try my best to follow the all kinds of activities i believe myself from my heart that our nation depends on us so if we do our duties properly our students will get better education thanks to all and now it is time to start day 4 uh, day 4 good morning and welcome to everybody dear honorable participants how are you now i am going to present my own journal based on activity day 4 our honorable trainer discuss about four sessions previous day it was teaching english at last class in a last class early reading and writing introducing reading and writing skill i have learned a lot of uh, activities from uh, the four session the most common feature of a primary school in bangladesh is that there are more or less 60 or 70 students sitting in a room at least five students sit on a long bench Uh, with another high bench in front of them to keep books on there is a chair and a table in form uh, in front of them for a teacher it is very difficult to teach and assist students learning in the session uh, our uh, participant will learn about how to how they can deal with major challenges now i can find out the challenges and possible solutions of that challenges i can take all kinds of steps to control the class so these are the uh, session and description and uh, point 2 i have learned many new things from the session what are the challenges and what are the possible solutions of a last class is very effective session for me and i get a clear idea every session is very helpful uh, for my professional development i believe myself that i could apply all new activities in my classroom in our eft every session has learning outcomes i shall try my best to do better i will follow a teacher's guide tg and teaching aids every early reading is very important to be a smart speaker in future early writing is also very important for good handwriting everything is very clear to me i enjoy all my session all the session are expert and clear to us every topic no session uh, is difficult to me there are the stages are reading there are the three stages of reading as a teacher we should follow every stages uh, from grade on we should focus on reading if we make our students free reader they will take responsibilities of their life every session is closely related to our eft content every lesson has a learning outcomes our main aims to acquire the learning outcomes of the session besides this we enjoy, we enjoy many kinds of warm up activities and game like activities such as mix and mingle game bingo games and games pre position games also some rhymes and poems and songs in my classroom i shall try my best to follow all kinds uh, uh, of activities a i believe myself from my heart that our nation depends on it on us so we need to do our duties properly our students get better education i want to i want to be smart a dynamic teacher pray for me thanks to all so this is the end of the uh, journal of day 4 and now we are going to our uh, last session uh, that is uh, here is the end of the session Uh, so uh, thanks for watching the video please don't hesitate to uh, connect with us uh, our is a mobile number whatsapp number and also email number uh, you can 
uh, give us proper suggestion and what have you uh, want to watch from my channel your channel uh, my channel is your channel also i see training for all channel please subscribe the channel and also visit the channel every time we will get update news for primary training so next see you next tutorial thanks bye bye